Okay, so the first thing we need to do is open up the plugin. So if you go to Pages, Add New, or Posts, Add New, you'll see a button under the title part that says WP Quick Pick Studio. So let's open up the plugin. And as you can see, you're presented with five options. You can search our main image source, make use of the image browser, search the WP Quick Pick Studio library, import images from your Dropbox or cell phone, or make use of the enhanced image upload. You can even add external image libraries from vector tunes and IM stock photos. So let me go through and just give you a quick brief on each one. Now inside here automatically loads up the most popular and the latest images. And you can just click load more and it'll load up more images. And this is great because sometimes you find some real hidden gems. Now if you click the latest it shows you the latest images. But let's do a search fitness. So you can see it loads up high quality stock images that we can use. And we click load more, it'll load more images up. So let's do another search, diet. Again, as you can see, these are all high quality public domain images. They require no link back, no attribution, and they're copyright free. And you can quickly and easily integrate them into your pages and posts in seconds. Again, if we click load more, it'll load up more stock images for us to quickly make use of. And again, seconds to put these in your page and your post that means this main source has over 80,000 stock images covering a, pretty much every niche you can possibly think of there's another search business and again if we click load more more images will load up okay so let's move on the next feature we have is the image browser. Now, the other image sites that we want to use don't allow you to scrape the results. And we want to make sure that, that we keep in with the terms of service of all of these sites because it's important to myself and my own clients. We want to ensure that we're covered. So by embedding them inside a browser like so, we're fully compliant with the terms of service. So let's do another search, e.g. diet. As you can see, this there's tons more images here. Now with the image browser, all we've got to do is just click an image we like. As you can see it. Right click, copy the image URL and just paste it. Then when we click step two, it'll automatically load the image in and we can start playing about with it. And I'm going to go over this in a second. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to go into is Dropbox. Now with our Dropbox, we can literally import images from our cell phone in seconds. You can get the Dropbox app that you put on your smartphone and every time you snap a picture you can just sync it to your Dropbox and then all we do is click choose from Dropbox, click photos and as you can see we can instantly access our pictures and these are pictures I've took on my cell phone personally. Then we can pick the images we want, click choose. Now you can insert each image individually but WP Quick Pick Studio has its own image library so that we can all share images we take ourselves with other Quick Pick Studio members. So once we've selected our images, we just click Upload and Share. As you can see, it loads our images. We give them a title, Rock, Rocks, Cliff, Mountain. And you just tag your images, Sea, Sea, Water, Boat, Sailing, like so. We confirm that we photographed these pictures ourselves and we own the copyright and then we click submit. And this will add all these images to the Quick Pick Studio image library so that other users can use your images and you can use these and we can quickly build our own internal stock image library. So let me show you the Quick Picks library. So this is the Quick Picks image library. This is where the images are stored when you decide to share your images with other users. And we can quickly access images inside the app, do a search. And then we can pull the images in instantly. Now the last option we have is the enhanced image upload. And what this does is it allows you to upload an image like you can standard with WordPress. But it allows you to resize it and apply an image filter on the fly. So let me sh let's pick some images and start resizing. Let me show you how it works. So let's select this image. 
first thing we can do is we can give it an SEO friendly name and completely rename it so let's call this workplace sign and then we click enter that completely renames the image now the next thing we can do is we can resize the image so we can have it whatever size we want like so now if we want we can add effects this is my favorite part because we can completely transform an image and make it unique with these effects and we've got over 15 image filters that you can apply on the fly now not every filter will work for every image type but you'll find one there that you like and you'll use a lot and we can make sure it fits with our site's color scheme or really make the image pop and if we're not very good at photography it improves our own images so let me show you the image filters we've got vintage lomo clarity and as you can see it really transformed each image sin city sunrise cross process orange peel love grungy jarkes pinhole old boot glow and sun this is my personal favorite hazy days so it gives it that angelic look her majesty nostalgia hemingway concentrate and as you can see you can apply these on the fly in a matter of seconds to find one that you really want then all we do is we click insert image and away we go as you can see our image is in the page to the exact size that we want we can resize on the fly by dragging the slider up or down add filters to really make our images pop and stand out and show exactly how you want them and even give them an seo friendly name once you insert the image it also automatically saves the image in the media library so that you can go in and find images if you want to use them again a picture paints a thousand words and with WP Quick Pick Studio, you can fill your pages and posts with high quality images to make them more engaging for your website visitors in seconds.